This chick who decided to record a hilarious TikTok where she goes into a grocery store, opens a bag of chips, takes a bite of one to test it out, doesn't like it, so she spits it back into the bag, and then, to make it even worse, she pulls out a straightener and crimps that bag back closed and puts it on the shelf. Oh, I uh, hope the ops get a hold of this one and she gets a huge fine or even does some time behind bars because if this actually becomes a trend, I'm not buying chips. This is disgusting and I'm pretty sure it's heavily frowned upon. What's going on, Modern Chodes? It's your boy Long Nail back again with another new video. And in today's video, we're going over the hot posts from r slash trashy. Let's get into it. 40,000 plus two feet of altitude. Nope, I'm just swiping those bad boys right off. Sorry, but I'm not dealing with that the whole entire flight. I don't care. You're uncomfortable? Oh well, should have done first class. That doesn't mean you get to put your feet above my head, which are absolutely disgusting and dirty, by the way, and just think it's okay. It's not okay. You're not more special than anyone else. You're not entitled to that space. That's my space. Get out of it. Due to too many customers being rude and belligerent, we'll be closing our lobby between the hours of 11 p.m. and 4 a.m. It's a sign that a donut shop had to put out because they live in a college town and those kids don't know how to handle themselves. Yep, that's definitely 100% true. I mean, I've gone to a few of those towns and I could definitely see why this shop is like, you know what, their business isn't worth it because those people just come in, they think they own the entire world and just act like, oh, what are you going to do about it? You want my money, right? So put up with it. Well, apparently they don't want your money that bad. While waiting in line to order food. This was the person's view. Mmm, yummy. That really just piques my appetite. Seeing two people do that and then sniff their fingers. Mmm, that, that, that smell is just marvelous. It makes me really want a burger. This guy really tattooed himself a hairline. Yeah. Tell me why this is going to be the Island Boys in 10 years. I, I mean, seriously. Well, well, what is going on here? This guy has so many tattoos, you can barely make out his face. I mean, maybe that was his goal. But at the same time, it's like you have so many tattoos now. You're the only person with that many tattoos that, that has a, a hairline tattoo. My neighbors. You know, sometimes I'm like, HOAs kind of stink. And then I see houses like this, and I'm like, maybe the HOA isn't all that bad. Because if I had to wake up every morning and look at that, I'd be pretty aggravated. And I can imagine that doesn't smell that great. So now you walk outside in the morning to get a breath of fresh air, and you just smell your neighbor's trash. Yeah, you know, maybe HOAs aren't as bad as I thought they were. They still suck, but this also sucks. Could people just get it together, please? Seen in a grocery store parking lot. When I asked the owner for some context, he said he was covering up hail damage. Hey, big dog, uh, there's a lot better ways to cover up hail damage. We all know that's not what you're doing here. You got some weird sort of fantasy thing going on. And it's extremely off-putting. Graduated a year ago, apparently this is what the new class is up to with their brand new iPod, iPad, iPod. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, you know, this is why schools don't even bother getting nice stuff because students think it's hilarious to ruin that. And what these kids don't realize is their parents helped pay for that stuff. Uh, like at no point if a kid got an iPad from their parents, would they go, hey, ma, dad, look what I just did. Yeah, uh, they would get scalded, rightfully so. But for some reason, you put them in school and they go, well, this is okay. It's just, it's funny money, right? Like, bro, how about you treat it with some respect? The school, you're lucky enough to be at a school that gives you iPads, iPads, bro, iPads. 
and you think it's hilarious to destroy them, dude. Uh, I would have done anything to have an iPad in school. That would have been so sick. But no, not now. Schools are just going to shy away from it. And they're going to be like, oh, well, bring in your own stuff. Not our problem. You just destroy our stuff. And then, of course, it's always the kids that actually would have benefited from this that treat them with respect. And the other kids just go, not my problem. My mommy and daddy could have bought me my own iPad anyways. And now there's other people that can't afford iPads that really would have benefited from having them that can't have access to it because you thought, oh, this make funny video. Woman caught feeding her hairless cat on a Delta flight. The catch here is that blurred out word it means she was feeding a cat like how she would feed her newborn. That's uh, extremely interesting. I would love to see how that panned out. Like, how does the flight attendant approach that situation? It's like, um, ma'am? Yeah, so I don't know how to tell you this, but actually, you're not allowed to milk yourself on a plane with a cat. Like, what What do you say? The, clearly, this person's out of their mind that, that, that they're going to be doing this in the middle of a flight and acting like it's normal. It's like, I, I don't even know what you say. There, at, at some point, it's like, uh, there is no right thing to say here it's just like hey ma'am uh yeah we're gonna have to ask you to get off the plane because you're just being ridiculous right now but uh, i highly doubt that's how this went please tell me somebody got a video of this there's so many videos of things going absolutely bonkers on planes that if somebody on that plane didn't have the wits about them to record them i'm gonna be more mad at them than at this chick for doing that and wasting everybody's time all right, modern chodes, that's it for the hot posts from r slash trashy. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications. And of course, share this video with your friends. And if you want to help support the channel for free, anytime you have any shopping to do on Amazon, just click the link in the description down below. Do your shopping as regular. It won't cost you anything extra and it'll help support the channel. So I'd really appreciate it. Until next time.